I'm Jim Stevens from Softion. In this week's Logistics Insights podcast, why you need a true platform for autonomous mobile robots in distribution. We will discuss that hot topic in just a second. This podcast is brought to you by Softion, providing innovative solutions for warehouse management, warehouse execution, and distributed order management. Softion, delivering supply chain success every time. Autonomous mobile robots, or AMRs, have taken the distribution world by storm, driven by both operational efficiencies and the challenges of finding enough labor in many, if not most, U.S. markets. The interest in mobile robots has been especially hot in e-fulfillment applications, both to increase capacity and to reduce the high cost of piece picking. In 2020, well-known Gartner analyst Dwight Klapik wrote that, Next-generation autonomous mobile robots are transforming operations as they become more autonomous and intelligent. Adding that AMRs are easy to buy and almost as easy to deploy. Given the low barrier to entry, combined with a strong value proposition, warehouse operations of all shapes and sizes will be able to invest in AMRs. Here at Softion, We believe that most distribution centers of decent size will have at least some mobile robots deployed over the next three to five years. There are a growing number of AMR providers. Those include Fetch Robotics, Locus Robotics, Geek Plus, Kindred, Vecna, Covariant, Mir, and others. A key point is that robots are designed for different purposes, from piece picking to case picking to -to point-to-point pallet moves and other tasks. That means you could wind up with robots from multiple manufacturers. And there's the problem. Many robots come with their own software applications to support their use. In most scenarios, the warehouse management system sends orders or other tasks to the robot software, which executes the work, with or without human assistance, and sends confirmations back to the WMS. There can be a number of issues with this approach. First, it means the robots are executing tasks with less than the full information available to the WMS. This can lead to suboptimal decision-making and challenges dealing with exception handling. Second, it means if you choose to use different types of robots for different jobs from different vendors, they operate in silos, perhaps not talking to each other. This limits efficiency. An example would be connecting an autonomous fork truck moving a pallet to a drop zone for pickup and put away by a different type of robot. Third, it makes adding robots from different vendors over time very difficult because you are reliant on the existing robot vendor's application software. So even if there is a better mousetrap, you can't use it. Recognizing these challenges, Softion has taken a different approach. We have developed an innovative solution that involves a single schema that can manage and optimize robots from any manufacturer. This means as tasks are created, Softion's WMS, or Warehouse Execution System, recognizes the type of work and assigns the tasks to the right type of robot, and then specifically to a robot of that type that is close by. It also means down the road, If you want to add robots from other vendors for capability, cost, or other reasons, those new robots can be added right into the current fleet and managed in one platform along with the existing robots. This means your investment in mobile robots is future-proofed. Autonomous mobile robots are coming to a DC near you, likely your facility too, and probably soon. Look for a software platform that gives you the most optimization and flexibility moving forward. Softion has a unique and innovative approach. You can find more at softion.com. For Softion, this is Jim Stevens. Thanks for listening.